Hello friends, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to fix Windows cannot print due to a problem with current printer setup. This is the our error and we are going to solve this error. So let's go to our video. First, minimize it or close it and go to the first start and here type registry editor and click on the registry editor. Click on the yes. Here we find something like this. Here first go to the H key current user, second option, go to the second option. In a second option, go to the software, here we find software, click on the software. In software, find Microsoft, scroll down and find Microsoft, here we find Microsoft, expand Microsoft. In Microsoft, find Windows NT, scroll down, it is at top, at the bottom, here we find Windows NT, select or expand Windows NT. In Windows NT, we find current version, expand current version. In current version, we find Windows. Here we find Windows, go to the Windows. Don't expand it, go to the Windows. In Windows, here we find Windows. Right click on the Windows and here we find permission. Go to the permission. In permission, go to the all application packages. Select all application packages, first option. And here we find full control, select allow. Click on the apply, click on the OK. Second option is once again go to the windows, right click on the windows, go to the permission once again and this time go to this add button, click on add, in enter the object name to select, here add everyone, type everyone, here type everyone, here type everyone and click on the ok, here we find everyone, select everyone, in everyone, permission for everyone, go to the full control allow click on the read allow, click on the apply, click on the ok, close the our registry editor. Next option is very simple, go to the principal, for that go to the start and type services, click on the services. In services we find many options, here find principal, here we find sprint spooler, click on the sprint spooler, right click on it, click on the properties. If it's startup type is not automatic then go to the here and select automatic, make sure it is automatic and here we find service status is stopped, then click on the apply, now start button is open, now click on the start, wait for a few seconds, now service status is running, click on the ok, service status is running and startup type is automatic is very IMP, click on the ok, apply and ok, now restart, select principal and click on the restart, wait for a few seconds, close it. Now next step is go to the Uber software or app and go to the control P and give print that you want, give the print that you want, I give this print. And this time there is no error, that means our problem is successfully solved. So guys, thank you for watching this video, don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.